Hello, Scorpio. It's my lady from my lady's way here, and I'm coming to do your weekly reading for the week of 9-18 through 9-25, 2017. So, whatever you're doing is basically like keep going. Okay, let me see. Keep going what? I don't know. This makes me feel like maybe keep going, uh... Trying to better yourself, trying to higher your self esteem. So, whatever that means to you. <laughs> All right. Um, if you want a personal reading, description box below. Thank everybody, and let's get this show on the road because I see your cards are trying to speak. Uh, what's going on for the Scorpio? Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio for 9 18 through 9 25 2017. Scorpio 9 18 through 9. 25 2017 Scorpio 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 918 mm -mm. Okay, somebody got a third party in and um somebody is trying not to look at it for what it what it is. Somebody trying to look past it. Okay. <laughs> All right. Scorpio Scorpio Scorpio. I uh, know I didn't say this, but I read the Cleo cards at the end, right out the book. But this is saying somebody is trying to make a wise decision here, okay? Okay, so somebody feel like them not looking at things for what it is is a wise decision. I heard I want to keep my marriage, so somebody looking over it to keep their marriage, keep their relationships or whatever to keep something together. Uh, it's crazy. Because um, even though you feel like this is a wise decision to try to look over this, this person is treating you like they don't want you. They straight up letting you know, but you're trying to look over it. Mm -mm. This is basically saying you have all the information that you need. And I feel like somebody, like, if I find this, I'm going to leave. If I find this, I'm going to leave. If I'm going to find this, I'm going to leave. But you keep finding this, but you won't leave. You keep making excuses to stick around. All right. So, um, all right. This is somebody either moving close or going on some kind of trip. What's up with this trip? What's this, this voyage for the Scorpio? What's going on? Okay. So something happened on a work trip. I, I believe I feel like Something happened on a work trip or somebody might be using a trip to possibly manipulate. Like, oh, if you don't do this, I'm not going to take you on this trip kind of thing, okay? But Or something just crazy happened on a trip and I feel like whatever happened on this trip was like the icing on the cake. Wow, okay. <laughs> this is saying that your future is looking good. I mean, whatever is meant to happen is going to happen. Fate is going to get struck. So it's like, um, no matter what you do, uh, what is supposed to happen, it's going to supposed to happen, whatever. I feel like it's going to be a breakup. All right, let's see what's this future fate. What's this future fate for the Scorpio? Mm. So some kind of sacrifice being made. Sacrifice. What's going on? All right, so... I don't know. So it seems like here somebody made a sacrifice with, um, so, or somebody just think that by sacrificing sex with this person, somebody's not sleeping with the person after whatever this certain thing that happened, and they feel like it's going to make the relationship better. Like, oh, you're going to do this? Well, I'm not going to sleep with you right now. But it's like fate is going to happen no matter what. It's like you already know. You know exactly what's going to happen. You know what's going to happen. All they're going to do is go somewhere else. You know, and it seemed like, I don't know. I might feel like you might be manipulating with this trip. I mean, this could be vice, either way. Yeah, but it seems like somebody is trying to hold back something that somebody want. But it's like you already know how this going to end. Like, I feel like it might be some something that goes over and over and over. Like, oh, you do crazy stuff. I don't sleep with you. And then you go sleep with somebody else. All right. So this makes me feel like, ooh, Jesus, both of you may be doing this to each other. 
Mm. It's like a back and forth thing. They do it to you, you do it to them. They do it to you, you do it to them. Mm -mm. All right. What's going on for the Scorpio? Scorpio, Scorpio. 9, 18, 9, 25, 2017. Love reading, love reading. Scorpio, Scorpio. Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio. Love reading. 9, 18 through 9, 2017. 18 through 9, 25, 2017. Damn. Alright, seems like somebody's sick of fighting. They feel like this love ain't worth it anymore, but they just don't want to let it go. I mean, they used to the, used to the same old song and dance. Jesus, success. Wow, oh, this is. Mm mm. Okay, so it seems like the the person may actually come back, but it's still a reoccurring thing. Like they gonna come back, and then they gonna do what they do, and then you gonna do what you do, and then it's gonna come back. Okay. Let's go. We have the nine of staffs. Um, problems of your past may haunt you. Enemies may be near. Be very careful with uh, your trust. Take what you have learned from the past and use it now. I feel like this is that. I'm not going to sleep with you trick. You know, I'm not going to sleep with you. Then they go leave and sleep with them. Like you already know what's going to happen because it keeps happening. All right. So now we got the Ace of Cups. Ace of Cups. Ace of Cups. All right, the Ace of Cups is reversed. It says malice, deceit, confusion, and counterproductive activity. That is what the hell is going on here. It's like you try to make this person do the right thing by not sleeping with them, you know, which is like... It's, it's just like a, a ammunition to go fire off somewhere else, you know? I don't know. Okay, then we got the death card reverse. All right, it says lack of direction and desire to remain in a bad situation. That's what's going on. I don't know. Six of staffs. All right, it says, and you may expect some good news very soon concerning your decisions you may face. Um, your hard work will soon pay off in victory. So that takes me back to here. You finding exactly what you want uh, and what you feel like you need to get rid of this relationship. So maybe it's the person, and maybe a new person, somebody that you met that can take you out of the um endless cycle of this madness and it may happen on a work trip you know but that's all i have for you guys make sure to check your sun moon and rising signs if you want a person reading check in the description box below other than that have a great week <laughs>